But you still have intercourse, though, right? Yeah, every now and then, if I feel like being charitable. If I feel like being charitable, you know. <laughs> you know, if, if somebody if somebody if somebody worthy of a blessing, but yeah. I'm but I'm not gonna release no semen. After she come, it's cool. Mm. Hey man, I do want to kind of ask you something that ask me about anything. The retention thing. I've heard that before about holding in your orgasm. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Mm -hmm. I'm glowing. Even when I'm not trying to. <laughs> your skin, your body is electric. That's what makes us glow. Our body is electric. You ever touched something and gave off static electricity? Mm -hmm. Somebody said, you shocked me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your body is electric. Your semen is your life force. That's your life force. It's so powerful Damn. that it can create a child. Yeah. It's so powerful that it go, it shoot what, like 500 billion and something? travel. Up the fallopian tube. I hate to even say this. You know, a woman's throat and her vagina, like her vaginal opening, is the same as above, so below. It's the same. You know, a woman could have a throat gasm? I don't, no, I don't know. I've been taking these, I've been taking these, like, like the spiritual side of sex, like what it's really for, like what it's really. And you meant. say you didn't even call it sex. Nah, I call it spiritual unification. Yeah. Like even just not even having sex, laying in the bed with somebody, you exchanging energy with this person. You could lay in the bed and say, I ain't gonna even fuck. I'm gonna play hide the dick with a little bitty bitch. Right. But you, <laughs> yeah, you know, cause I, man, I'm about to, I'm, yeah, she, I'm gonna make, hey, I'm gonna make her chase me down, homie. I'm on the phone telling my big brother, I'm gonna make this bitch chase me down, homie. I'm gonna play hide the dick with a little bitty bitch. I'm gonna make her wait. Yeah, I'm gonna lay behind and make her wait on that bitch. But you still, I was still waking up tired. So I'm, I, I started doing research on that too. I'm not having sex, but I'm still waking up exhausted because I'm exchanging energy by you just mm. being in the same bed as me, in the same room with me. So imagine how much energy you're exchanging by releasing your life force. Mm. Then it's gonna be hard for the first Hey, like, do you know Shaka Bars? Mm -mm. Look up Shaka Bars, bro. Good spiritual brother. He's in Africa now. My brain don't work good after I done release semen. It don't work as sharp. When I'm when I'm charged up about a good 90 days, now like you might have a wet dream every now and then. So I say, like, you know, you still practicing semen retention because you're not jacking off. You're not beating your dick. You're not doing none of that shit. So, so you practicing semen retention, you retaining it. So your orgasm gonna be on the inside your body. It's gonna be different. It's, you're gonna feel it. You're gonna, you're gonna, how they taught me how to do it was to suck your navel all the way in and bring the energy up to the crown chakra. This is my first time talking about how I do it. You, they got a part called the Bulanganda. It's in between, it's like what well, some people would consider they gooch. Mm -hmm. And you squeeze that and don't release no semen. Like right until the point where it's about to go, you squeeze that part and you suck your navel in and you make the energy go all the way to your crown chakra. It's going to explode. What that feel like? God, you're going to be so powerful. You're just going to feel like a, you're going to feel like something different. You're going you're gonna to feel like something different. How long have you practiced or studied or knew that? Man, I'm talking about after that, I noticed when I start doing it, I run and don't get tired. I start just challenging myself. I go lift weights. I just started notice I'm getting shit accomplished. Boom, bam, boom, 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 boom. I'm, I'm focused. Shit weird. It's like limitless. Hey man, and you know how back in the days you would hear somebody say, oh, no sex during training camp. No, you know, you're gonna lose your legs, you're gonna lose your energy. Do you feel like- I retain like more information. Like if I read something, I retain it more. I'm not lazy. I'm just, I still like the, you know, every man you gonna wanna, that's in our nature. But you could take that sexual energy and translate it. Sex transmutation. And you translate that energy into something else. Like, Do you still, like, when you in, but you still that's why doing I, it, I, right? I exude, you still I exude so much sexual energy because, like, right now, I say I want to, uh, no disrespect to you, you're a beautiful woman, and I, I want you. Instead mm -hmm. of going to talk to you and get your number and all that and trying to get you 
if I take that same energy, that same fire, and go to the gym and work out, I just took my sexual energy and put it somewhere else that's going to better serve me. But you still have intercourse, though, right? Yeah, every now and then, if I feel like being charitable. If I feel like being charitable, you know. <laughs> you know if, if somebody if somebody, yeah. if somebody, worthy of a blessing, but, yeah. I, but I'm not going to release no semen. After she come, it's cool. Mm. I'm going to make her come a lot of times, and after that, it's over with. But then I pray before sex and everything. It's a, it's a very spiritual experience, and a lot of times. But it wasn't always like that. Uh, not to this degree, because I'm just, I'm so in tune, I tell you, it's different. So I really don't be having the time to do all of this shit with no woman. And most of the women don't even be worth all that. Mm -hmm. I'm wasting time. I could have been doing something more productive. So then sitting here, I got to, I got to bathe you and get all that shit off you that's on you, all that, that energetic, psychic debris off you and. Then I got to get in here and pray with you and all this and to bless this act because we got to bless this act. In How long has that been, though, Kev? You always supposed to bless this act and make it sacred. And, you, okay, let's say you always supposed to, but... See, here he go. But no, I'm asking... No, you say you always... <laughs> you supposed to. Now, sometimes yeah. you're going to have... Sometimes you're going to want to... <laughs> you're going to want to get in there and do it, but you're going to feel bad afterwards. Like, damn, man. My dick wouldn't even get hard without the permission of the creator. I'm supposed to involve the creator in everything I do. I'm supposed to, but I ain't do it this time. I'm going to feel fucked up. God, and, God gave me the opportunity to bless this beautiful woman, and I ain't even, even involving. When you, let's say when you first get on, right, and everything is being thrown at you. You, you know, didn't part, partake. But I, I, I was somebody before I came in the game. Say that then. You know, a lot of niggas, you know, they came in the game and got round people and Started stealing a little bit from here and a little bit from there. I came in the game, Kevin Gates. Yeah. Like, I was already that thing. Damn, man. And, and the reason why I did ask is because I can see now. That's why I'm so relevant off social media. Because I'm really out you. Mm -hmm. You going to see me somewhere. So are you completely off social media? Or you just kind of, you got to tap in? I make, because it's like I make, gift vi I make videos and... uh. My manager just posts certain but shit But you're not sitting there scrolling and wasting energy and time. I ain't got time, time, to be honest, because I'm going to see something I don't like. Mm -hmm. And then I'm that's energy. I'm, I'm I'm still consuming that. That's consumption. That's why I got off, bro. Yeah, that's consumption. I, I'm, I'm cool. You heard me? Now, I'm going to have to get back on in a minute. You know, I'm yeah. going to get on there and let them see the, you know, I'm going to let them see the kids. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, your way. But how I might do it this time is I let, I let my manager just completely run it. Mm -hmm. And I just see him what I want him to post And you know it'll go like that Cause I can't sit there and just Cause mm -hmm. I already don't give a fuck So right. it don't like I don't care what they say about me on Shade Room None of that right. Cause you ain't gonna see it in my face